Hey guys and welcome back to another episode of Sky Wars and what a start to 2017 I have had. I've been sick, I had my birthday, I had three college assignments all released at once and I have a whole new monitor, a new like PC setup which is pretty pretty cool so I hope you all have had a... Uh, a good start to the year. Mine's been interesting. Mixed, you know. My birthday was good. The monitor is good. But, uh, can't say the illness was great. And the three college assignments also not so great. So, I suppose it's a, it's a bit of a balance. But, you know, I'll get through it, man. It'll all be good. We'll power through. And everything will be cool. And, uh, yeah. I've actually updated my setup. So, I'll put a little picture here of what my setup currently looks like. So, my new monitor is the one on the left. The one on the right is the one I've always had. Just a standard. ARC like 1920 by 1080 60 Hertz monitor and actually have two of those the problem is as I've mentioned many a time I am not currently in my room it's getting like redecorated and everything but when I go back up in my room the other monitor that I had because I had two of the monitor on the right before um, will come back when, because on this table I actually don't have enough room so uh, that will come back into play so I'll have a three monitor setup which will be awesome but what's so special about my new monitor, the one on the left, is, uh, yeah, it's big and pretty and the colours look amazing. But it's 144 hertz, which is beautiful. So for those of you that don't know what 144 hertz is, it's uh, basically the standard refresh rate of monitors is 60 hertz. And that means that the picture updates 60 times per second. So it's basically like 60 FPS, like 60 frames play in a single second. Um, so obviously that looks pretty good. 60 uh, 60 frames in one second very detailed very smooth animations and everything and uh, that's why it's used in like most monitors and standard TVs and stuff but more recently with like the popularity of esports and everything 144 Hertz monitors have been developed which obviously offer uh, 144 frames shown in a second rather than 60 so it's like over 2.5 times smoother and like I would like to say as a little disclaimer if you are thinking of buying one from me talking about it in this video uh, you do need like over 144 frames in like most games that you play to actually notice the difference otherwise you'll just get a load of screen tearing and stuff but like it's so so good like I didn't realize how much this monitor would actually help me with aiming but it just has helped me so much with aiming both in Overwatch and Minecraft and everything and uh, a beautiful thing which is probably the best thing about it is because of how smooth it is and moving around and stuff it's just got like tons of inbuilt motion blur and as you guys know motion blur looks really really cool there's loads of Minecraft mods that you can put on that give you motion blur and stuff but obviously this is motion blur in everything and I don't need any mods or anything it's just absolutely gorgeous and I, like I said I actually couldn't believe how much better it just made aiming feel it just makes everything feel so much better but the problem is for you guys you're not gonna notice a difference because sadly YouTube doesn't let me upload in uh, 144 FPS and obviously you need a 144 Hz monitor yourself to be able to view that video in 144 FPS so yeah you guys will never see what it looks like so uh, the video is just gonna look as normal as ever for you all uh, but my aim might look slightly better because it certainly feels better and uh, yeah, it's it's kind of weird as well because this new monitor's on the left, and I'm used to having my main monitor on the right, so it's a bit weird to be looking at the left. And obviously, you can see from the picture I changed the position of my microphone because from uh, my live stream where you all would have seen my face and everything with the way the mi the microphone was, it was like um, just chilling, hanging in front of my face, but now it's kind of like slanted just in front of my face. And I don't know how this will sound. Look at him; he's doing the I am Stone challenge. Hi, man. I really wonder where he is. This guy's got me good. Wait, right, so there's a guy over there. I don't think there's a guy around here, okay? <gasps> he just unshifted. He gave himself away, man. I was giving you the benefit of the doubt, but you just gave yourself away. You can't unshift there. That's not how that challenge works. <laughs> oh my gosh, so many people have been doing it lately. When I recorded the video, I didn't realize the sheer amount of people that I did it. I did it because so many people had suggested me to do it, but damn, I've seen a lot of people doing it. Anyways, we've got to go over and stab this guy because, uh... I don't know. I feel like it. I'm a cruel, cruel person. And I know as a result of this video and as a result of the picture and everything, people are going to want a setup tour. I get a lot of requests for setup tours. So uh, I do plan on doing another one at some point because I did do one in the past. But obviously a lot of my gear has uh, changed since then because in that setup tour, like half of my gear was Razor stuff. And uh, a lot of that stuff actually broke on me. Kind of sucks. But uh, oh well. So 
once I get back up into my room and it's all decorated and stuff, I will do a setup tour because, like, the gear won't really change between now and then. But, like, I'll actually be able to get my third monitor set up. I will, um... Oh, he tried to block me off. That was rather rude of you, man. But yeah, I'll actually have my third monitor set up. I'll have, uh, like, my proper desk and everything with everything on it. I'll have all my LED strips set up. And obviously, LED strips, you know, they're not going to give me, like, a thousand FPS in mine, man. But they're going to look cool. So, uh, that's why I have the LED strips. How can you not just have LED strips, man? They were suggested to me on Amazon. I just, I just couldn't resist just the clicking of it, you know? And I don't know why I don't use enderpals, by the way. I know a lot of you guys call me out on it. But I think that I have some kind of hidden allergy to enderpals. Because, like, half the time I don't get them. So, whenever I do get them, I just assume that I don't have them. Because I normally don't have them. So, then I look down at my inventory. I'm like, oh, yeah, they're there. I probably should start assuming that I do have them. I mean, that will probably lead to a lot of deaths, but maybe I'll actually start using enderpals again. And oh my gosh, we actually su survived that. And we got the kill as well. Legendary. All right. Power one bone, man. Epic weapon. This guy is shifting and he has fire res. Uh oh, he has eggs as well. I'm not a fan of those eggs. Can, uh, can you put them away, please? I don't want to. He did put them away, but at the same time, I don't really want to sword fight you, though. I'm quite liking this little bow lock I got you in. You know what? He's pulling out the eggs again. I don't appreciate you. I can't tell you how good PvPing on this monitor feels, guys. It's amazing. Oh. You took my kill, man. That was rather rude. People are enjoying the eggs today. And I'm actually so low on health. What am I doing with my life? Um, you know what? We're going to go for you anyway. I don't care about HP. Who needs health in Minecraft? Am I right? Health in Minecraft. Everything is okay. I don't know whether the mic would have actually picked me up somewhat talking uh, more quietly there because I added my noise gate. Keep forgetting about that. Plus, my mic is in a different position. So, I didn't actually check that. Maybe it sounds alright, you know. Uh, it's pretty much the same distance from my face. I didn't change any of my microphone settings or whatever, so it should be okay. Uh, uh, maybe we do need health in Minecraft now. Okay. We're in danger territory there, guys. Okay, we got enderpals now. We got some floating fire that I kind of want to get rid of. I don't want to burn while picking up my enderpals. Thank you very much. And uh, we'll just get ourselves up a little bit more and go after this guy. We don't need full health. We never need full health. Bye-bye. So... I'm going to end the episode there, guys. If you enjoyed this episode of Sky Wars, please be sure to leave a like and consider subscribing. And I would like to thank you all for all the get well wishes on my last video. Uh, I did actually get worse following that video, which is why I haven't uploaded. But uh, I'm feeling fine now. I've got a little bit of a blocked nose. But as you can tell, my voice sounds normal again. And I'm all good. So, yeah, I'll see you all next time. Bye.